I'm Trisha Keen right now on your 13 Action News update. A Las Vegas woman is accused of stealing more than $80,000 in watches from men staying at the Cosmopolitan. Police say 23 year old Wendy Rose Jones stole the jewelry from two men while she was in their room. Detectives believe the alleged thefts might be related to prostitution. One of the men told police he may have been drugged as well. Teen Talk is coming to Southern Hills Hospital. The free program is being offered to local teens for mental health support. Hospital officials recognize it's been a tough year and many students have lost a loved one to COVID-19. There has been an uptick in suicides as well. And you can register by calling the number on your screen 702-290-7725. Limited services at the DMV may continue for a while with full capacity possibly returning by June 1st. Officials say that they are looking at their options. Right now, only online appointments are being accepted. One of the main issues is more employees are needed. We have to plan this out very carefully. Uh, we, we do have a staffing shortage. We're gonna have to hire some people and ramp it up slowly. Officials are also reminding not to buy an appointment from anyone online. They will not be accepted at any locations. Danny. The wind speed finally calling down for your Friday as temperatures bounce back to the mid to upper 70s should be a beautiful end of the week, but it is cool to start the day in the low to mid 50s before our highs climb to the mid to upper 70s. Near normal for this time of year, a lot of sunshine, just a few clouds mixing in tomorrow afternoon. By Saturday and Sunday, the breezy wind returns and a big warming trend kicks off early next week. Highs climb to the mid 80s by Monday. That's where we hold for the majority of next week as the breeze settles in. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.